let's do this. Um, somebody said, what up, family? Somebody said, um, any thoughts on IBM cybersecurity certificate on Coursera? Coursera is really dope. Like uh, Coursera, if I'm not mistaken, uh, they're also doing the Google support IT certification. So Coursera is incredible. Another one I would recommend is Udemy. I've taken Udemy myself, actually. You know, um, Udemy is incredible because it has like a lot of entry level courses and stuff. IBM cybersecurity certification. Um, my opinion on it is uh, I really this is the first time I've heard about it. Uh, that being said, one of the things that you want to look into whenever you try to get a certification is how how popular is that certification? That matters. To give you an example of why that matters is because um, there's a certification called the CEH, and it's it's a certified ethical hacker sort of certification. And it's got a lot of traction, like uh, HR departments, companies know what, exactly what it is and what it does. Um, it's for it's for people who do pen testing. It's for people who are looking at cyber threats, cyber threat analysis, things like that. Now, in the hacker community, if you if you talk to most hackers, people have been doing this for a while. People really know what they're doing. They hate that certification. The reason why is because the certification is kind of a. Not I won't say it's a money grab, but it doesn't. It goes into a lot of the tools that you use for the trade rather than the actual theory. And I haven't read through the books for CEH. I would I would disagree with that. They teach you a lot of the fundamentals that it takes to learn the basics of hacking um, and goes a little bit deeper. So I would say it was from basic to intermediate, um, but it's kind of got a, an unfair shake, in my opinion, from the hacker and, and the pen testing community because it just doesn't go deep enough and they want it to be more hardcore. If you want something more hardcore, you want to go to the SCP, uh, o OSCP or Kali Linux, stuff like that. Those certifications have more hacker respect. What The point I'm trying to get at is CEH is a very marketable certification. If you have that certification, you, you're looking at, and, and a little bit of, of um, experience under your belt, you're looking at six figures. But that's because it's a popular certification. So IBM cybersecurity certification, I'm saying, is, is not super popular, I'm guessing. But let's take the guesswork out of it. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go to I'm going to go to a site and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about as far as uh, marketability of certifications. You want to look at the marketability of a certification. Let's go to Indeed.com, one of my favorite sites to go to for job searches. And uh, I'm going to show you, let me show you my screen real quick. While I'm doing this, somebody asked me what search do I have? I'll answer that in a second um, while I'm doing this uh, C CISSP and um, CAP and a, a few other ones. But let me show you what I'm talking about. I mean, you cannot see that. Okay, I'll just walk you through it. Okay, so I've got a bunch of people watching. So I'm on Indeed right, right here, and I'm going to type in uh, IBM. Uh, what did you say? Security certification? He said cybersecurity certification. Cyber. And this is what you want to do with any kind of certification that you are trying to pursue. You want to see the marketability of it. Cybersecurity certification. And you can just go to any kind of job aggregator, such as LinkedIn, Indeed, Monster, and just type it in. So it says there's no searches, but that's because it's it's only searching in my area of Colorado. Let's look at all the United States and let's see how many certifications. Uh, how many people are looking for the certification? So I did a search here and it's saying that there's 11 jobs looking for the IBM certification um, where that keyword came up. And really, it's not even it's 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 keying in on certification security. It's not really finding the IBM certification, but let's let's take an equivalent certification. Let's say equivalent of cybersecurity certification. Let's say it's uh, security plus. Now, watch this. I type in security plus CompTIA. In fact, let's let's narrow it down. CompTIA security plus certification. There are nine thousand jobs. That's what that says right there. Nine nine thousand jobs for the CompTIA security plus. And look at the look at what they're paying. Now this is for a junior ethical hacker, but that's not bad. Not bad at all. So, and it's getting you into ethical hacking, which is which is pretty good. It, it's I so my opinion about the IBM certification is doesn't have traction just yet. Um, a lot of these vendors will try to create their own 
and this is coming from somebody who has vendor level certifications. I'll, I'll get into what kind of certifications I have in a second, but vendor level certifications, some of them don't take off. Some of them don't, they lose traction. Um, they, and because it's the company, the organization doesn't market them effectively. And what they lack that some of the certification organizations have, a couple being ISACA, which has CISA, CISM, uh, C risk, and some of the others, CompTIA, which has A plus certification, Network plus certification, Security plus certification, and others. And then you have uh, IS, IC, ISC2 squared, which has CISSP and um, a couple of other big time certifications. What these guys do right is they market the certification. They know who to talk to to get in on these lists, the government lists to say, hey, these are approved set of certifications. They market it so that other people have to take the cert. And then it becomes a requirement like they did with the CEH. The marketing on CEH is, is incredible. Like They did a great job on the marketing aspect of it. So my opinion of the, the IBM uh, cybersecurity certification, it doesn't have traction just yet. I would I would probably go for something like a security plus if you're trying to get in the field and make money. So that's my opinion about it. I hope that answers your question.